What motivated you to do this? Why did you want to tell these stories? You know, in the beginning, you know, it was just uh, I got a phone call from, from Spike's office, and it was like, you know, Spike, Spike wants Jones. to meet you. Yeah, yeah, Spike Jones wants to meet you. I'm like, well, okay, you don't, you know, we go meet Spike Jones, and he basically he just offered me the job. And I was like, well, you know, you don't tell Spike Jones no, but I honestly knew I had not a clue what the heck they wanted to do with me. I was actually freaking out in the meeting, like, what do they want with me? You know, and I'm like, okay, yeah, you know, cool, cool, okay. You know, and- Because this is a form, it's like a form of journalism. It is, know. and I was, uh, you know, I, I have way too much respect for what, you know, journalists do, especially investigative journalists, when they go out there and really put their lives on the line and get the truth. I, I just have too much respect for that to try to just jump into it. So I was a little intimidated. And, uh, you know, the first couple of, episodes, you see me trying to like struggle, you know, the, the OCD actor in me, I gotta know my lines and look like I'm, you know, I know what I'm talking about. And that failed miserably. And I, I, got, a, I got a reality check. I said, you know what, Mike, let it go. You and I both know, I'm talking to myself in the mirror, I said, you and I both know you are not the sharpest knife in the drawer. So stop faking it. Just go out there and let people see you learn. Let people see you just ask the question. My mom always said the dumbest question is the one you don't ask. And I just went out there just being me and letting, letting the audience see me learn, see me get invited into the world. And it, it was an organic, it was, became real and, and that's where the magic started to happen. You know, you get these moments that you can't plan for. And uh, that's wow. Black Market. And you know, I got to meet a lot of beautiful people. So congratulations on the new show. Thank you. Congratulations well, on the new show. I also want to say, you know, um, on this journey, what, what you're gonna see is I got to meet a lot of beautiful people. You know, um, you know everybody's in pain. And, and you know, whether we're white, black, male, female, young, old, across the world, we were in Cape Town, uh, London, Liverpool, Chicago, Atlanta, it was one common thread. No one was proud of what they were doing, breaking the law and living below the, the poverty line. And if they had an opportunity, they would do better. You know, and that was, across the line everyone shared that that uh that sentiment and it just made me it just i don't know i i, I felt i feel enlightened it was a lot of darkness i saw but i feel i feel enlightened for having being given the opportunity to share people's pain well there's a lot of pain a lot of darkness in the world right now and thank yeah. you for sharing these stories with us thank you, it was to meet you. Thank you so much thank you. black market with michael k williams is on viceland we'll be right back with a performance by parquet court stick around